In this tutorial, we'll talk about how to split frequencies using bus sends in Logic Pro. This technique is useful to add stereo width to lower frequency sounds. Bus sends are used to send a copy of the original signal into an aux track, which you can then use to further mix the signal into your session. To demonstrate, I've loaded a Logic Pro template from beatelite.com. This one's called Prog House Volume 1, and in it we have a mid bass line. So I'll solo the bass. You can hear how the high end sort of has a left-right feel to it. So to split the bass frequency, what's been done is that the original bass signal has been sent to bus number 9. So if we were to bypass this bus send by clicking option click, we'll just hear the original bass sound. Now I'll reactivate the bus, option click. A channel EQ has been added to the first insert of bus number 9. So if we open up this EQ, we'll see that everything underneath 240 Hz has been cut out, leaving only the top portion of the bass. And we'll bypass the EQ. That's the original bass sound, and now cutting the lows. After the EQ and distortion, there's a sample delay plugin. Now this is what's adding the stereo width to the high frequencies of the bass line. As you can see, the left channel has been offset a few samples from the right channel, creating a stereo effect. Now if we were to link the left and right, we'd lose that stereo feel. Let's unlink left and right and bring the right delay back to zero. Now, splitting frequencies is useful in this case with a bass because low frequencies are less directional than high frequencies. That means that when a low frequency plays, it's difficult to perceive the direction from which it comes from, and panning such a frequency is impossible. High frequencies, on the other hand, are more directional. Splitting frequencies allows you to process different frequency ranges of the same sound in different ways to create more interesting and dynamic mixes. Join the conversation by following Wink Sound on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube to keep up with everything you need to know about music and audio technology.